Welcome back to the basement. The spookiest, scariest stuff in front of us here. Uh, we're going to descend the staircase. We're at the end of the Tears of the Kingdom, I do believe. And I'm a bit nervous. We'll see how this goes. We've got three 15 Gloom Heart deals, uh, five triple attack ups, and ten full recoveries. I don't know how much Gloom is going to be a part of the final battle or not. I may need more Dandelion Meals. But when we take a look at the map, it seems as though we're going to head this way and then this way. And I'm guessing we're going all the way to here. Before we actually face off with Ganondorf. So we'll see how it goes. I've never done this before. This is my first time. It's, uh, let's see, May, June, July, August. The game's been out for three months. And, uh... I really played a lot of hours in that first month and a good amount of hours in that second month and I have slowed way down as sort of real life and summer and all that have happened. Oh, why am I... okay. I gotta be careful about the gloom here. Should I be attaching stuff to this? Probably. Didn't even hit him. We're getting that music. Ooh. I wish I were headshotting him. Oh, Waited way too long there. You can't pick up the broadsword. We're getting some... This is really just, like, wearing us down, I think. Okay, we're gonna want... Uh, this. I think. Because the shock will, uh... Make these guys vulnerable. That one's definitely awake. Is he gonna alert the others? Just wanna sneak strike this guy. Okay, now they're awake. So hit him with the electric, and then finish him off with the master sword. Ugh. Out of my way. I could be using Riju for this, except I don't think I can access the dudes right now. Okay, and that. Okay, now we have some more Gibdo bones, which is nice since we just used some up. I wonder if this is meant to like deplete what you've got, you know? That's the point of this. They seem to be stocking us up a little, but also taking from us. By the way, cool environment here. This is giving me shades of what happened with Princess Zelda. Is this the room with the, yeah, where the keys, the three keys can kill you right at the beginning of the game. That's so funny. But now we can uncover the rest of this, uh, the rest of this here. And I think we're supposed to. That might be the way out there. Okay, so we looked at this before. There's the dude with the seven stones. And then there's him and his wife. And then Ganon, yeah, defeats the wife. And then the armies, right, led by Ganon. So let's see what we got up here. Ganon looking very frightful. Wow, that's 3D too. On the wall there. 
Hold your nose. Got your nose. Ganon. Alright, and then there's Zelda with the sword. Wow. Interesting. So before Zelda even did this, in a way, in like our timeline, the story was already here. And down below we have these people looking up at the light dragon here. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. We've actually gained arrows. So we're going back down to the site where we first found them. In the beginning of the game. Whew, I need some coffee. Ah, this is scary. I'm tense. I'm going to turn up the volume in my room. Just a little bit. Shouldn't affect you unless the, my microphone picks up the game audio. It's a fair bit of gloom. We could put on the gloom clothes. Or we could just navigate. Prison chamber. Oh, man. All right, here we go. Down, 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 further down. Gloom's Lair. A torch. Do we need a torch? I don't think so. more intense. Saving. I feel like I'm getting further from the dot on the map. Oh no, it's another jump point. We're going deeper? Boy, is this spooky. Now I actually have to turn it down a touch. Okay. I don't know where we're landing. On this thing? Is it gonna hurt us? Can we go past it or do we land here and turn this way? This definitely looks like something. I don't know if this is going to be gloom or not. <sighs> okay. Holy smokes. All right. Well, we got some help from Tulin here. You have to fight all by yourself, you know? Alright. Uh huh. That's right! I mean, I hope so anyway. Link! 
shall protect Hyrule together. The bird I owe you for your help. You can count on me. Oh, only because you owe us? Well, I think the strategy here is going to be to just let them take these guys out. I mean, why not, right? It's a little less cinematic. I don't want to use up all my stuff. Is this thing just going to follow me? Ow. Did not want that. Oop. Uh, maybe attack up would be a good idea. Or am I going to give the Master Sword time to recharge? Or is it going to recharge automatically at the beginning of the fight? Yeah, what do you think of that? <laughs> this is cool. I like this music. Got a lot of stuff to pick up. Oh, I'm getting gloomed. Are they dying easy? I think they're regular Bokoblins, which helps. That's a black Bokoblin. That's a regular. Oh, look at all these arrows. I guess this is a... Uh, nope, I don't want to be on you. A clever way to stock us up with arrows. And maybe some Bokoblin horns to put on the arrows. Anyone else here like the Western, American Western movie influence on the music here? I wish I'd gotten gloomed none. Swords run out of energy. That's fine. I have the feeling that it will recharge extra quick. Oh, wow. Okay. So I'm going to eat a gloom meal after all this is said and done, I'm sure. Um, do we want to save this for Gibdos in the future? Well, we do have Riju, so she could probably help. Maybe we use this. Or maybe we destroy the fused material and put something better on it. Yeah. Uh, destroy fused material. Let's put... Uh, one of these on it. Ow! Am I still holding it? I'm not. Where'd it go? Bet if I turn on the fuse. His elbow's Talon. Where'd my. Here it is. <laughs> A lot of stuff on the ground here. I wonder if the game's going to slow down. Okay, we're down to a quarter. So I guess the Bokoblins were half. 
Oh, we are gonna want electric stuff. Okay, where's Riju? I guess we could do this. Ooh, that's a slow weapon. Ugh. Want something faster. Um, like this. Okay, electric. Then strong spear. Whoop. Get out of here. Oh, two hits killed him. Oh, no, it didn't. Not quite. Now we could use um, these, which we have a bunch of, to help out with these guys. Zelfo tail. Get dough wing. The Demon King's army is not depleting by much, is it? Percentage-wise. Oh look, he's down for the count. Is that it? Yes. Okay, what's the next wave here? Moblins. Makes sense that we'd see moblins at some point. We've seen coblins and lizalfos. Okay. And... Not a very good, well-timed dodge, but that's okay. Oh, you know what? Would work well here. Two-handed weapon for sure. Got him. Got him. Get him. Got him. Got him. I wasn't watching the health bar of the army. Is it toast? That gloom. It means but one thing. The demon king is there. Or right behind you. Oh my goodness. More obstacles in our path. But our foe is mistaken if he thinks this will stop us. Are we really fighting them all simultaneously? Or is this gonna be a cutscene? Oh! So this will explain why they're occupied. We already beat them once. This will be a breach for sure. It is time, Link. The rest is up to you. Okay, I was wondering if we were going to actually have to fight all of them or not, but it seems like they do that. And I do this. Okay, let's eat a meal. And let's see, seven hearts and three. I need three. There's three right there. Stealth up for 30 minutes. That seems like a good thing worth selling. Uh, maybe one of these. Yeah, this will be fine. All right, is the sword back? It's not. Oh wow, and it's got a ways to go. So, we 
We want to carry something cool looking. How about this? So that's where they are. They're fighting the big guys out there. We're heading on this way alone. <clears throat> I'm taking a sip of coffee. I think that I will get a percentage completion uh, number on my map. Look at the clouds. Like I'm kicking up clouds there. It's funny. Oh man. Oh man, oh man. I mean, this is it. <sighs> okay. Is this a throne? I wonder if that's a line you get from the light roots. You haven't uh, overcome yet. I'm gonna take that stone from your forehead. Thinking of David sinking a stone into Goliath's forehead. Do fire a little fireball at me? He's got some nail fungus he needs to take care of. Huh. Get an actual Ganon here. Regardless, I will reshape this world as it was meant to be. As it was meant to be. Any opposition, I will rule. That is what a king must do. <laughs> nice. Yeah, cool. How's your weapon durability? Is it going to last the whole fight? And more importantly... Oh, there's the Master Sword. So it's back. Okay, so I don't know how this is going to go, and I don't know if attack up's going to help or not. I think I'm going to try to land a hit before I do attack up and then I'll do another one. Is he going to gloom me? That is a good question. He can gloom me with that sword. Okay, we're gonna eat an attack up meal here. And this is form one, I'm sure. Okay, jumping doesn't work, he's pretty fast. Ooh, but he hesitates. Whoop. That was a side dodge. Oh, does he create gloom on the floor there then? Hey, he switched to a spear. So I'm going to try the old, like, shield. Ooh, that's a cool move. Um, I'm kind of tanking here, but with my attack up, I'm doing okay. 
Yeah, how you like them apples? <laughs> um, I wonder if I have good stuff to attach. Like this. Take this. You missed. Cool club, though. Ha! Ding! I'm gonna finish him off. Oh, nice. Blood surges in my veins. And I am not even near the limits of my power. Good. Okay. Looking gnarly, Ganon. I appreciate it. Enjoy these I wonder if he considers me a worthy foe yet. Be taking far more than your arm this time. My other arm? My leg? Wow, cool. Look at his health bar. Hey, Tulin, they're back. Glad you guys are showing up. Ow. We settle this now, I want the real one. Yeah, you. I love that his health bar goes way to the right. That's really cool. Ah, would have loved to have gotten a flurry rush there. Do it again. Ooh, a third time. There's a lot of Ganons around. <laughs> it's just tank versus tank right now. I'm really enjoying it. It's almost like they combined um, skill and picturesque. Oh wow, that's a that's a lot of gloom effect there. Okay, are these shadows gonna like? Stick around after this guy's defeated, I wonder. He's pretty cool. He's pretty cool looking. Let's eat one of these. Okay, it was not all, and that's okay. Uh, we're gonna need an attack up. Oh, look, the yellow. Pushes the gloom over. So it's fine by me. Ooh! Alright, so if you get him before all the other ones are defeated, it doesn't seem to make you defeat those. Fool, that was only 99% of my power. More Mr. Nice Ganon. What's this, just a better weapon? Or is he gonna transform a little bit more? Oh, he's ready. Oh, I see. It's the halfway point. Yeah, 
Yeah, go ahead, tough guy. Oh, I see you pull out your bow and so does he. Ah! Unsuccessful dodge. Whoa, he could flurry rush me? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Oh, I was not anticipating that. That is very cool. Ow. Okay, attack up is over, which means it's time to eat another one. Um, I wonder if I can lose the Master Sword during this fight or not. Ugh, jumped at the wrong time. What happens if I just keep trying to attack? Does he actually... He doesn't flurry rush, he just flurry dodges. So we need something else. I have to flurry rush him. Nope. Okay, do your thing. Swing. Oh, that was a sideways one, and I missed it. Oh, wow. My shield broke. That makes sense. this one. Oh boy, he just, just seems to be unhittable at this point without doing a dodge. Oh, did that heart go permanently away? Yeah, you can't hit him. Even in the afterglow of that, we have to dodge. Oh, I hit jump. It wasn't enough, though. Okay, swing your sword. Dang it. That's not good enough. Swing your sword. Too early. Boy, oh boy. Boy, he's just tossing those aside, too. Aha! Some hits. Taking advantage. So while he's changing weapons, is a good time. Fire these things at me. Oh, Flurry Rush! Okay, good. Um, that didn't help. Yeah, switch weapons. Oh, one hit. Okay. Side jump, and I did the backflip. Swing. Dang it. Come on. I hate the spear attack. Here he comes. Come on, do your... Too early. It's okay, we can still get in there for a couple. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad, just dodge. We have to get out of the circle, right? And he shoots those things. Whoop! It's a little quicker. Here we go! Oh no! For real? A 
couple more in. Just gotta wear them down. Okay, when he's doing transition stuff, you just gotta get in there. He's down to his last hit here. Oh, did you see that? I swung the sword right through him. Okay. Playing that a little too cinematic, I think, at the beginning. Now, will there be another form? Will there be a beast? I don't know. We got the first form, and then the second form had the huge health bar. And at the halfway point, he did what he's doing now. What's your plan? Is he going to become the Dark Dragon? Oh. He is going to turn into a dragon. Fight this dragon? <gasps> Is Zelda gonna fight the dragon as the light dragon? Oh my gosh, maybe we'll ride on the light dragon's back. I heard someone say my name. Okay. This is very calamitous. Now well, we've got a Ganon dragon on our hands. I guess it's not a dark dragon, more of a gloom dragon. That's really cool looking. <laughs> All right, Zelda, here we go. It's love versus evil. She's gonna fly right into his mouth. Seems as though Zelda remembers something. It's pretty impressive that he's faster than she is, even though he weighs so much more from the looks of it. Are we actually gonna do battle here? Thanks for the sword, Zelda. Oh my gosh, we're really fighting! Uh, okay, how does it work? Jump off is X. How is this going to work? Can I turn Tulin on? 
He is on him. Come here, you. Oh boy. Oh, it's gloomy. Come on, come on. This isn't doing anything. Link, go! You're getting gloomed. Can I not this? Okay, maybe I have to land on him. Uh, Zelda? Little help? Yes, please. Thank you. Okay, am I controlling her? I'm not. So she's helping me out by giving me height. And I'm trying to get to his face. What does that do? Oh, look. Okay, we got that bit of him. All right. To go like this. I actually gained arrows throughout this process. Okay, adios. Whoops. Okay, into here. Come on, you big gross creepy eyeball. Alright. Now I'm guessing it's face time. Right here. Thank you. Definitely up here. That's it. Come on, Link. Pull that thing out of there. Stab that sword in there. Ooh, final attack! <laughs> He's a worthy foe now. Uh, Zelda. Thank you. <laughs> I knew you'd catch me. Hopefully the ancient magic dictates that if uh, one dragon is changed back by the removal of a stone, or the destruction of a stone, that anyone else is changed to a dragon because of a stone changes back. Where are you going? <laughs> wow! I am become death, destroyer of worlds. Oh.
Oh, 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 so cool. Ooh, just goosebumps. Tearing up a little bit. Am I going to get my hand back? Dude, if my hand changes back and Zelda doesn't, I don't know, man. Oh. It was all a dream. Oh, I've been transported to, uh... Whatever, the spirit places where you talk with the... Ancient ones. And they say, Ganon was trying to keep you from finding that stone. Now I'm in Zelda's space? Hey, what's up, guys? I found all your shrines. Oh. Yes. Help me. Yes. What great music, kind of hopeful and mysterious. Yes! What if she had a green arm too? So how long has she been a dragon? Long time. Did I, did I do it? Is she Zelda again? Where's my shirt? <laughs> it's interesting that he's wearing the blue pants that I put on him. So it seems as though no matter what, this cutscene is always shirtless and headgearless. But whatever pants you choose, that's what pants he'll be wearing. So you could try to make it a funny cutscene by wearing funny pants, but you can't wear, like, the Bokoblin mask or anything. Uh, how are Link and Zelda going to get down? <laughs> Uh-oh! You better go get her, Link. Oh my gosh, I have to do it, don't I? Okay, dive to Zelda. Hold R. I'm holding. I'm gonna get her. I'm gonna get her before she hits the ground. Come on, Zelda. Come on. Just keep falling slow, okay? I'll catch ya. We'll use the paraglider together. What if I miss her? I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Reach! Grab! Ugh, Zelda! Come here! Finally! We dropped her in the opening cutscene of the game. Missed her hand then. Got her now. Ugh, that would be rough. Do not attempt. I would have thought he'd try to like wake her up and say, you hold on to me tight, and then use both hands on the paraglider. This episode of Tears of the Kingdom brought to you by Everlane Jeans. Link is wearing Everlane Jeans currently. As you can see, they are both fashionable and functionable. Link, how are you? Is 
she thinks he went back in time. She doesn't remember that she went forward in time. Slowly. Yeah, I saved you. We reached you, after all. He's gone. The Demon King. I'm not in a dream, right? <laughs> I don't think so. You did it. Oh really shucks. That's what I do. It's a long story. Let's grab some burritos and I'll tell you all about it. No. I understand. Does that mean we're not gonna have burritos? I had been sleeping all this time. But when I felt something like a warm, loving embrace. I woke up. Thank you. Link, I met such wonderful people. I saw Hyrule as it was. Mm -hmm. I have so much to tell you. So much happened. Mm -hmm. Oh, Link. I'm home. Yeah, I actually watched your memories. So I'm basically caught up. Let's focus on now. Boom. We found her. So now what? Is there more story? Is there credits? There it is. Tears of the Kingdom. We did it. Curious to see what my percentage is. I'm hoping it's over 50, but I know that with so many Korok seeds, each counting as a small chunk, that it's not close to 100%. So I'll watch them another time. Sorry to skip the credits there, folks. I mean, people who worked on the game. Oh! I wonder if you see something for watching all of the credits, too, other than just this, you know? This is what you get if you skip the credits. Maybe there's more, I don't know. I can't believe such an impressive landmass can float in the sky. Just when I thought I'd started to figure the Zonai out. Yeah, well, they're full of surprises there, Pura. Everyone, I am glad I was able to bring you all here. I wanted to share this view of Hyrule with all of you. Mm -hmm. Wow, I've never been this far up before, Goro. Wow, what a sight it is. And Zelda, you were roaming the skies all along? Mm -hmm. Yes, although I don't really remember. It's probably a blessing as long as it was. Actually stand here again. This is only a theory, but Raru's power of light and Sonia's time power. For Zelda to transform back, they both must have channeled their abilities through you, Link. Yeah, they did. I was there. I see. Thanks to them, man. Can Link and Zelda finally like fall in love and get married now? Now it seems it is my time. Minoru! Do not worry. You have overcome the burden my era left to you. You have proven yourself and you no longer need me. I Where will you go? Move on. Join Raru and the others, and the world will be safe. Hmm. Perhaps in the next life. Oh. 
Bird brain had a thought. They all suddenly realize they need to back up. Those of us gathered here swear on our lives to support Princess Anna. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a really good picture of Riju. Ah, she remembers. Ravel and Sonia will be happy to hear of this. <clears throat> yeah, we got it under control, Minoru. But Minoru. <laughs> I mean Minoru. And now let them know just how much you care. Okay, it really sounds like uh they're still conscious, you know, somewhere. So they are implying some sort of next life. Which I think is a thought a lot of people like to believe in. Nintendo's, you know, they shy away from religious stuff, but I suppose that's a fairly safe concept. Wow, that really reminded me of the birds flying toward the sun at the end of Mario 64. Oh, but the construct robot just laying there lifeless at the end is a little, a little bittersweet. King Rara, Queen Sonia, Minoru, the ancient sages, they wished not only to save Hyrule from the Demon King, but for it to see eternal peace. And that's our job now. I dedicate myself to that goal. Yep, you're in charge until you appoint someone now, else. And for all time. Well. My friends, with all of your strength, stand with me. Okay. bittersweet for me too i look forward to this game for so many years and uh i'll never experience that for the first time again but man that fanfare so good so so good okay so let's see now uh where we're at because I want to look at the map and see if it gives us a percentage now that we've beaten the game. I think I think that's what Ted's theory was. Oh yeah, so Ganondorf there, he's been added. So if we go to the map um Oh yeah, 56.9% out of 100. Whew! We got a ways to go. All right. Well, uh, I mean, that's going to do it. Uh, thanks for watching. Maybe I'll um, play some more Tears of the Kingdom and Basement Let's Play in the future. Uh, this profile as I seek to drive that 56.9% number up. Um, but probably not right away. And uh, there will be Tears of the Kingdom stuff in the basement, of course bunch of that 
Uh, but I thank you guys for joining me for this, and um, I'll see you all next time in the basement. <laughs>